He running up. <laughs> he ch this, look. He run up on every, every, any and everything. So remember I told y'all about the hating ass dude when I was talking to the shorty that had the bald head last time, right? So he got mad. We was talking to like two girls. I was really helping Sean out and uh, Chaz. And he got pissed off and was salty because we were sitting next to his fucking little Bahaka shit and we didn't buy one drink with him. I'm like, bro, we don't want to drink from you. And what makes you think I would want to drink from you after that whole ass shit you did? So he was just like, if you're at least going to film in my area, can you at least pay for my Bahaka if you're going to have it? Like, hey, he paying shit, bro. <laughs> Niggas out here having a calm, bro. Back to another video it's your boy vibe for it today we got quite a few subscribers that's in the area uh we went out last night all three of us all four of us and uh it was it was kind of whack i'm not gonna lie uh the vibes was not in the clubs which is really shocking for a thursday uh so we're gonna try it again today we're gonna hit the beach uh, one of them leave tomorrow, so got to make the best of his last full day here in Salvador before he take off. Uh, so we're going we're gonna to rock with it today and uh, create the vibes. You already know. What up, guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Vibing with Fred. And we are finally going to the beach. We got Papa Sean. What's your name again, bro? Marco. Polo. So uh, Chaz, I don't know where Chaz is, probably working somewhere, but we finally got to the beach. And then later on today, we got a festival in the streets of ba Baja. Aqui amigo, obrigado. So, bon trabalho. So this evening we got a, uh, we got a festival going on. So we're gonna check that out. Sean's last day before he take off, man. And uh, Sean been kicking it with your boy every day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, you wanna hear something funny? Everywhere we go, they be like, yo, is this your dad? <laughs> I'm like, bro, stop saying this shit. But, but Marco just touched down. Marco just touched down. Uh, when you got here? Uh, yesterday, yesterday at two, two o'clock. So this is first time to Salvador. You've been to Rio before though, right? Yup, yeah, yup. Yeah. So, first time is everybody you know it's funny everybody that's here right now this is their first time in salvador but they've been to uh they've been to brazil before so uh we about to have a good time man and have some caipirinhas of course because shit i've been waiting on i've been waiting on them for like hours just trying to get out here marco about to get in time out <laughs> So we finally found the Wiz. Here we go. <laughs> the long lost caveman. This nigga been MIA all goddamn day. Now we finally found his ass. And now we got the whole game complete. <laughs> all right, so we just passed this girl in the street. And Marco got a message for y'all brothers out there. Go ahead. Hey, if you got, if you in shape and you got them fat, like ankles and fat feet, but you got like, you know, your body, body together. Man, that shit turn a nigga on, man. I love that shit. I love to see a woman with them fat, pretty feet, fat ankles. <laughs> I love it. So he about to run up on Shorty. Where your book? Where your book at? Let me show y'all. Yeah, yeah, look. Look, my man got the book. <laughs> I think I got him on video last night in the club. Come on, let's go. Let's go see Shorty. So he about to try to get Shorty right here in the purple. Here you go, making his way.
<laughs> this nigga didn't walk right past, bro. Here we go. He didn't came out. She over here looking at me. He said, you need to be worried about uh, getting hit by this goddamn car. Well, she's still looking. All right, so we got Marco right here. He just got to Salvador yes, yesterday. Uh, what do you think about Salvador so far? And I love it. I mean, it's a different environment. Uh, you know, our people here, you know, our people here. And uh, I don't know any Portuguese, but I can tell the people are welcoming, you know? Yeah. yeah. Uh, not, not really stressed out. Like, you see people back in the States, people, they put on, like everything's all good, afraid to let you know what's going on or whatever here. You can tell that people are more genuine, they're more, you know, they um, more honest, I would say, you know, not fake or whatever. Yeah. yeah. What's your, what's your, what's your, <laughs> you got a nickname now. What's your, what's your take on Salvador so far since you've been here? Man, if I had to describe it, I would say it's more like, it's nothing like it, you know what I mean? It gives me kind of more like a Brazilian version of New Orleans. New Orleans? Like I've heard people say that in New Orleans or Atlanta. I'm gonna say New Orleans. You know, you got the food here, black hair, you got all that. You know how New Orleans is, if you've been. Anyways, go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck what I'm saying. That ass <laughs> All right, Big Sean in the building. Leaving in the morning, man. What you think about it so far? First time in Salvador. Liked it. Nice, chill vibe, friendly people. Uh, hospitality here is one of the best that I've been to since I've been here. Traveling in Brazil on my sixth trip. So if you want to come, everybody think about coming to Salvador. Just don't think about going to uh, Rio or Sao Paulo. Venture off in the country. The other, other beautiful spots in the country. In the <laughs> McDonald's. McDonald's. Fala direito. É para você falar que você fala aqui. McDonald's. Burger King. Burger King. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> Netflix. 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 Facebook. Facebook. What's up? What is that? <laughs> uh, Instagram. Instagram. Twitter. 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 TikTok. Meu 